Good morning, everyone. My name is Akash Agarwal. I'm the co-founder and CEO of GreenNode, and I'm joined with uh, David Green, who is in charge of our marketing. Thanks, Jim. Um, what is GreenNode? Well, you all have kids. You all have people that are going to college, and uh, affording college is no longer an easy thing. So getting a student loan for a student is no longer a trivial matter, as you all know, because the cost of education is skyrocketing. It's not keeping up with uh, you know, incomes and people's uh, inflation, et cetera, is, is forcing the colleges to increase the fees faster than uh, people's income and other things. So that's a big problem today in the market. And the other big problem in the market, as you all know, with the current credit turmoil, uh, student loans are becoming uh, very difficult. Students don't have a good credit history. They're beginning their credit life cycle and are uh, being forced to get very expensive lo loans. This is where GreenNote comes in. And what GreenNote's trying to do is something very simple. We're just trying to help students secure low-cost loans from their friends and family. And what we do is help formalize that loan from, from their friends and family, their social network, and get it uh, to the school uh, through, through, through social networking means. I'm going to now pass it over to David, who's going to give you a quick snapshot of uh, how our system works, how easy it is, and then I'll wrap it up. Thank you, Akash. So our application is made up of two pieces. Make a social networking application we call the pledge process, where the students go out to their social network, friends and family, to see if indeed these people will come forward and lend them money for college. And the second piece is a financial services application, where the money actually changes hands. I'm going to go ahead and show you the pledge part for now. And I just uh, shortcutted it a little bit. There's a registration process that people would normally go through. I uh, didn't want to bore you with that. Show you the really good part, which is where the student tells their potential lenders about themselves, what school they attend, what activities they do, what high school they went to, anything that they think will help show these potential lenders why they're worthy of their loan. So this is a completely filled out profile already. Uh, they could go ahead and change any of these issues anytime they wanted to. I'm just going to go ahead and go to the next part of the application, which is where a student looks at the communication. So first what they do is tell us what lenders they want to communicate with through email. So in this case, they're going to talk to lender one. And this person's name is, uh, let's say it's uh, George. And they're a family. And they could put as many lenders as they want to put here. And there's also ways for them to add them much later in the process once they've already gone through this process. The next part of the application is the communication, the actual email that are sent to the lenders. Now, we provide this template. A lot of the students, I think, are going to just go ahead and accept the what we have already given them and go right through. But they have the opportunity to customize the major communications to those lenders any way they want. Finally, we have our obligatory legal. And with that, and our lawyers are here. Um, with that, the pledge drive has started. Emails have gone out to all the potential lenders, asking them to help them out. And the final part that the lender, uh, the uh, student would see at this point is the borrower dashboard, where they can see that, indeed, they've contacted these lenders. They get status of where they are. Have these lenders pledged? Have they actually funded that loan commitment? Are they in repayment? Things like that. I'm going to move and show you the uh, lender side, the friends and family side of it. So typically what you would see is that the student, or I'm sorry, in this case the lender, would get an email. Ah, this, this is the email I just sent a few seconds ago saying, please pledge for me. This is the email that was in that template. Could have been customized. I didn't do that. And hopefully they would read it, get excited about the student. Probably they know something about this person already. And they'd go ahead and view the profile. And they'd see the profile that we just looked at a minute ago from the student's point of view. And the uh, potential lender here has a chance to pledge, remind me, tell me later, or cannot help. Hopefully, most people would want to help this student, and they go ahead and say, let's pledge for them. Now, it so happens that this lender is a very excellent lender. They have helped out a lot of students in the past. So they already have a registration, so we don't have to go through that. And we'll just log into their account. And indeed, they see the pledge page, and they say, OK, I'm going to pledge $1,000 for this student. They can see the position of the pledge drive. Since we just finished it, it's already zero. This is the first person pledging. And they're done. That lender has now pledged to help the student. 
Now, going downstream, we have the process of funding, where both the student and the lenders have to provide the confidential information to make it a formal loan. We formalize the loan. We do the documentation. We're not a lender. We just put the parties together and help them do the transaction. I hope you come to our booth to see the funding side of this. Thank you. Yeah, currently we're in a closed pilot working with a number of schools. Our model is very school-centric and uh, we'll be launching very soon, as I mentioned, to Jim. So I think what I want people to take away is we are unlike any other lenders. We are not looking at the student's credit because if we looked at the student's credit, they wouldn't be even here. I mean, their FICOs are going to be way below 520 or whatever they, they happen to be. So all we're doing is helping students use our platform to connect with people that they already know and get them to loan money at, at very low interest rates and you know, basic savings on our model is less, uh, you know, over five, 600 basis points from what they would get if they qualified for a, what they call a private loan in the industry. And you know, our, our model says, go and get all the free money you can get, you know, grants and, and, and awards and federal loans like Stafford loans, and then come to GreenNote to expand that. Thank you very much. We look forward to seeing you.